the toolkit you're looking for ought to be in my old shelter. It's been tagged, so shouldn't have any trouble finding the place. I'll unlock it remotely once you get there. Oh, and take some of those hematic grenades you brought with you. Nothing you'll want more when those BTs put your back against the wall, right? Here's hoping it won't come to that. Order assigned. someone very, very happy with your contribution. Thank <laughs> you. 
And that makes them as bad as him, don't it? It's as if all the motherfucking terrorists are coming together like one big happy family. <laughs> Might be time for us to do the same. Maybe there's hope for us after all. <laughs> At least if there's more folks like you in the UCA. Safety in numbers, huh? And the new America to boot. Connect me to the chiral network. Right. Now that you're looking out for me, it's only fair that I look out for you. So, as long as you keep me connected, keep on supplying you with my best tools. And together we all might live a little longer. Oh, by the way, check out this beauty I made. It's called a Bola gun. Should keep anyone from giving you trouble for a minute. It's non-lethal, of course. I can't promise it won't leave marks, but that's on them. If you think you could use it, take it. A Bola gun, huh? That could come in handy. As is, you can use it to restrain human targets without killing them. But swap out those wires with strands spun from your blood, and it might even work on BTs. Go ahead. Give it a whirl. Well, you've done your bit. Time for me to do mine. Thanks. You did me a real favor there. Thank you for your contribution. Excellent work, Sam. You've brought three way stations into the fold. The preppers are on the grid and the chiral network is looking better than ever. 
We're planning to use the regional distro center as our next way station. But that'll have to wait. Got a priority task here. A mess in need of cleaning up. We need you to recover one of Lake Knot City's system servers. They sent it out for repairs and mules hit the transport on the way back. The server contains validation data for a new delivery system we're deploying. Once in place, it will use the Cairo network to automate deliveries. To us, it's invaluable. To the mules, it may as well be a toaster. A toaster they'll happily tear apart for the Cairo crystals and rare earth metals inside. If we don't act quickly, we could lose that data. So get your ass to the mules drop site, snatch the server, and bring it back to Lake Knot City. I'm putting the order in myself. Check your cufflinks for details.
Uh huh. You've got the server. Here, let me have a look at it. Nice. The great deliverer comes through again. The server's in perfect condition. It's a real relief to know all our records are safe. Thank you so much. Sam, I've added a reverse trike to the list of supplies you can fabricate. Lake Knot City was kind enough to provide the blueprints as thanks. I'd tell you all about it, but, uh, didn't you used to have your own? Same deal. Two front wheels, one rear, battery powered. Fitted with an auto charging unit that kicks in when not in use. Requires skill to drive over obstacle strewn terrain. Best suited to long flat stretches, yada yada yada. We're working on securing you another vehicle, so you can look forward to that too. Thanks, Sam. With that data, we can finally move forward with our plans for the new automated delivery system. I'll tell the boys to start testing the bots right away. Now you'll need to take it to the distro center south of Lake Knot City. Check the delivery terminal whenever you're up for more work. The preppers had some things to say about Fragile. You sure we can trust her? That business with Higgs. Thought I told you she hates him with a passion. Enemy of my enemy as far as I'm concerned. Don't take my word for it, though. Just ask her, and judge for yourself. But like it or not, we need her help. Sam, it's fragile. I hear you brought three preppers into the network, and delivered everything they needed. That's some good work. Long as we're shooting the shit, you mind telling me what the deal is with you and Higgs? Been hearing stories, huh? I'll tell you all about it. In person. Meet me at the distro center, south of Lake Knot. You're headed there anyway, right? Good work. New order available. Please access delivery terminal for further information. Hmm. Sam, a lot of clients are requesting you by name. Now, while there are orders we need you to accept, which are critical to the expansion of the Cairo network, there are others that you can take or leave at your discretion. It goes without saying, though, that it's in everyone's best interest for you to do as much as you can. And more work means more rewards. Center south of Lake Knot City. If these autonomous delivery bots prove reliable, they could revolutionize our supplies distribution network. A lot's riding on this, so be careful out there.
Zan, looks like you're coming up on that auto paver. Get it going and you'll have yourself a road in no time flat. A highway used to run through there back in the day. The first expedition team left behind a paver, but to finish the job, you'll need more than that. You don't have the materials for the paver on you. Okay then, head back to Lake Knot City and grab what you need. Or if you're feeling resourceful, you could try scavenging for supplies with your cargo scanner. job, Sam. That road is a sight to behold. This is only the beginning. Creating a transport network that spans the continent is keyed off. Future. That's why it's important that you utilize any and every paper you come across to rebuild our highways and byways. Imagine how much easier your work would be if you could drive from coast to coast. don't cause void outs. They can't die. They don't have beaches. No matter how far they come, machines will never understand death like we do. And because of that, they'll never truly surpass us. Get on the delivery terminal. I'll walk you through how to use the bots. And don't worry, I'll keep an eye on things from over here.
These autonomous delivery bots are designed to process some orders for you. Simple, run-of-the-mill orders only. Take a look at what's available. Cargo transported by a bot is liable to get a little roughed up if the road's poor. On the flip side, a bot traveling on a well-maintained road is more likely to deliver cargo in better shape. Also faster, in case it wasn't obvious. Keep that in mind when sending them out. Now we wait for the delivery bot to reach its destination. As of today, there's just one, but if the test succeeds, we'll move ahead with mass production. Then you'll be able to dispatch them yourself. Oh, um, seems I misspoke. We managed to slap together another delivery bot for field testing. You can decide how to use this one. <sighs> Sorry, baby's fussing again. Thanks, Sam. We'll talk later. Good work, Sam. These autonomous delivery bots will benefit everyone, from folks in cities and way stations to preppers out in the back of beyond. But you must be exhausted. Why not take a break? I bet your BB could probably use one, too. Head for the private room. Go on. Sorry, didn't mean to startle you. You were sleeping when I dropped by. Thanks for the shower. Right. Look, I gotta ask. I've been hearing things about you. She's in bed with terrorists. Don't trust her. She's just another dumbass Higgs fucked over. She's a goddamn hero, that woman. <sighs> Tell me, Sam, what does America mean to you? The way my dad made it sound, we were something special. The glue that held it all together. More than a nation. A symbol of freedom and hope. We could bring it all back if we kept on making deliveries and connecting people. He was sure of it. I was a wreck after he died. That's when Heeks made his pitch. Together, we can run packages from sea to shining sea. 
back then he had a monopoly west of here. We both stood to gain a lot from a partnership. Business was pretty good at first. But then, a year ago, when those fanatics started stirring up trouble, fuckers hijacked our system. Somehow they got a hold of our security passes and used them to sneak into cities. And just like that, we're delivering guns and bombs instead of medicine, and I didn't even know. We were just cogs in a terrorist machine. Higgs was behind it all. And on top of that, he got his hands on an old school nook that I ended up carrying right into Middle Knot City. You tell me then. Yeah. It was me. I blew it up. Could have been different if I wasn't so fucking blind. So I did everything in my power to stop South Knot City from getting destroyed. I tried to get the nuke out of the sea. But Higgs was one step ahead. He took his pound of flesh and then some. Some wounds. They don't heal. Whatever time I've got left, the rain took. So there you have it. Everything's true. Except for all the lies. I don't give a damn about bridges or putting America back together. But I'm not about to let Higgs and some terrorists take my father's legacy and shit all over it. That's why I came to you. So, trust me now. I'll be there for you, Sam. All you have to do is call.